Hey guys, Mike here with The Gamer Show, and today we have got a vertical mouse. It is a wired version, and this is the JTEC Digital wired uh, vertical mouse that we have here. Um, laser mouse, you can see this is the, the box, product specifications, and also a little bit of a uh, kind of like an illustration of being using a horizontal versus vertical. So let's go ahead and take this out of the box real quick here. And once again, they made these boxes always that was a little bit easier but the other ones are always a pain in the butt as you can see here this is a like a palm rest it's got the two little notches similar to the other mouse so we will take this one out of the box and just like that we've got the little happy card no real instructions except for this guy here um, it's pretty simple guys there you go. So that's a uh, pause it when you want to read it. All right, so let's take this guy out of the, the box and uh, see it's what it looks like. It's got like the rubber grip over here, it feels like, and they got a DPI button at the top. It looks uh, forward and backwards. Looks like you can easily put your thumb there and uh, yeah, that's kind of different. So this one, um, this one definitely using the middle finger for that. A little bit hard to tell from the camera, but you can see there. Let's put on the the bottom piece here. You can see the two notches again that we were talking about. Go right in there, and it pushes up and snaps into place, and then you put that there. So I've got another vertical mouse here to compare it to. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to put this forward here. And you can see that it's kind of a, a, a crazy difference there um, in height. This one obviously comes down a lot more. So maybe about half an inch. Um, this one feels pretty good for like holding it like you're, you've got a fist like this. Um, this one, however, feels very, I don't know, I can't figure it out. It feels pretty loose. Now let's compare it to another vertical mouse here. And you can see we have in order of how tall and how wide it is, you've got the standard mouse, which this one is uh, looks the same, like on key, et cetera, et cetera. So grabbing it, it feels like with my hand, it's... Uh, lot larger so it feels like um, this one would not be for my taste however for people with medium size to small hands would be great for this design um, but this one here has a cool perk because it's rechargeable and it's also wireless which is great uh, this one here this one feels pretty good um, it wants you to use the um, again it feels like it wants you to use the, the your, your ring finger as the uh, the right click and the left click for your this uh, left click for your pointer finger and then the middle finger for the scroll wheel. However, I'm a, a two finger type mouse guy, so I tend to put my both my fingers out of the way and let them do everything um, for that model. But the deluxe, this thing's really big. Um, it, it's a lot smoother. Um, this one has the um, like the configuration of the gro you know, the grommets here. Not really grommets, but they're kind of like indents on the plastic. Um, this one, again, catches your hand along with this. But on the deluxe here, um, it's smooth. The whole mouse is smooth. So it's like, you know, you're trying to grab onto it where you grab onto here and it's a lot more rugged and it's got traction. Um, this one's pretty smooth, so my hand will slide. But um, I have oily hands. So I think that this one might be better for not sliding around and feeling more natural. Um, but this one here um, feels really good because it's taller, it's higher. But all right, guys, well, that's it. Uh, that was a, um, a quick unboxing, a quick comparison between three different vertical mice. Uh, but this was the JTEC Digital wired vertical mouse that we uh, we just unpacked together and got some kind of debris on it but there we go that's better but here you guys guys got it uh the mouse is unpacked and ready to 
to rock and roll. But thanks again for tuning in to the, uh, the Gamer Show, and we'll see you next time. Have a great day.